Hi guys, and welcome back to the channel. We have so much to talk to you about. She's yes. back. Oh, she's back. She's back. If you didn't already know, Rosie is back. Rosie's back. Something's happened and a weight has been lifted and my wife is back. Okay, so as you can see, Rosie is already prepped with her headgear. As you know, I do not prepare. I think this is me getting in touch with my divine feminine self. This video is sponsored by Surfshark. Thank you, Surfshark. And we'll get into that in a second. Hit it. Fluids. Nightmare in Wales. Fluids. Nightmare in Wales. Fluids. Nightmare in Wales. Fluids. Fluids everywhere. Film. Nightmare. Tembi. Tembi fish and chips. <laughs> you Tembi fish and chips. You ruined our life. We need a Fluids. holiday after our holiday. Because Fluids. Rose's bum is sore. I knew it. At her bum and said, Have you got Fluids bum? Everywhere. Right? No. no toilet roll. <laughs> no towels. Sick on the bathroom floor. See BB's arm repeat. Just in the towels and the stuff that I like. Yeah. <laughs> See BB's arm repeat. 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 In case you didn't already know, Surfshark is an app or browser extension which lets you place your laptop or device anywhere in the world and lets you access the internet as if you're in that country. This means if you want to watch The Office, just turn your location over to the UK and start cry laughing away. It doesn't monitor, store or keep track of your online whereabouts or actions in any way. Surf in a clean cyber ocean with no ads, trackers, malware or phishing attempts. I hate fish and chips. Surfshark is a VPN that offers one account to use on an unlimited number of devices. So use our code Rose and Rosie to get 83% off and three extra months for free. For this month, Surfshark is giving away their antivirus for free. Surfshark even offers a 30 day money back guarantee, so there's no risk to try it out yourself. Link in the description below. Yeah, so Rose, we thought she had bum grapes. But okay, it's no, fine. Wait, hold she on. Have bum Rosie, grapes. you're bringing them in at the She's end of the movie. You're bringing them in at the end of the movie. Okay. okay, so what happened is, as you guys know, we worked very hard on the podcast, and now that that's over, we wanted to have a break. We wanted to go on holiday, so we booked something very exotic and went to Tembi. We booked five days away, Airbnb, cliff top, right on the beach, perfect. Yeah. I get there, loved it. Beautiful weather. We get there of an evening. Of an evening. We're on the beach. Beautiful drive. And stress we were like, free. do you remember when we filmed that video about our terrible holiday in Cornwall and we couldn't even get fish and chips? So we were like, this is the life. There's like five fish and chip shops. Let's roads. just take a pick. Yeah. We picked 10 B fish and chips. Pretty standard. How can you possibly go wrong? It was good rated. We got some fish and chips. Ironically, they ran out of fish. All right. right. And we were like, doesn't matter. I'll go to order. Jumbo regular chips. The classic jumbo lesbian sausage, order. A jumbo curry sausage. sausage. Right. We were like, chips and curry nice. sauce. Nice. You even said this curry sauce is chef's kiss. Yes, and I was I like, did. isn't it just? I said I could drink a pint of this. I'm glad you didn't. You might have died. So the next day I get up and I'm like, oh, I feel a bit, I don't know, feel a bit, feel a bit off. But I was fine. I was like lethargic, having a lie in. I was like, yeah. oh, it's nice not to have to rush. I was like, this is great it? taking it slow because normally Rose is so like, I've said it before, but she wakes up like this. <sighs> I'm up. I'm doing work. We went into town and just the idea of walking into a shop and sitting down for a drink was making me like feel weird. And I was like, something is wrong with me. And then I said to Rosie, I was like, Rosie, I'm seeing double. It's really weird. I think I need my eyes tested or but something. I think I've got anxiety or she something. She does say this to me a lot. You say it like most days. I was in bed and I was like, I am really cold, Rosie. I'm going to have a bath. I got out and this is what happens before I vomit, right? Me and my mum have this reaction where we go so faint that all the blood rushes from our head and our extremities. And I had rigor mortis claws. She was going on the floor. She went, Rosie, I'm fainting. And I ran in. She went, look at my hands. So there I was. Yes. And I was so aggressively. Violently sick. It was like sprayed everywhere. I was like, oh. Every two hours for the next 24 hours, Ziggy started projectile yeah, vomiting. So Ziggy still and got we it. were like, right, that's it. I started and having a panic attack. And then had a panic and went, I'm fainting. I called an ambulance. <laughs> I called them at 3 p.m. They're like, they'll be with you in one hour 45. I was like, thank you, my baby is so ill. Yeah, he was really ill. It was, it was scary. He's never Six been ill Six hours later, they call me saying, no one's coming, just so you know. But a nurse practitioner really should be nurse with came. you soon. 10 p.m. that night. All I'm saying is it got bad and I didn't eat for six day and I mean nothing. I didn't eat anything. You I look like, you know in the Adams family, what Uncle Fester. 
Um, and also, if you're not already a member of our channel, become a member because I actually started a huge holiday vlog before it all went tits up. And then I, did, I actually decided to vlog some of my food poisoning. <laughs> uh, I'm going to show the members that because it's so personal because I look you don't want everyone so bad. It. This is my face. This is the sh this is the worst holiday I've ever had in my life. Uh, but if you want to, it's available. Become a member of the channel. Also, we're doing another live <laughs> what stream. I add, if you want to see if some you food see poisoning. How awful I look with no makeup BTS during food content. poisoning in Tembe, a bit BTS. And we're also doing two live streams a month for the month of June and the month of July. So that was what I looked like. But apart from that though, it was my birthday and Rose's birthday. And yeah. we actually had our first proper date because oh Ziggy is starting nursery now. I went. For a we meal, went, we went to the, to the cinema. cinema. And then Rosie was such an old bitch because she was like, how much did that just cost me? I no. used to, let me talk about it, right? I used to work at a cinema, right? It used to cost about seven pounds a ticket. It literally cost 20 pounds a ticket. I'll bring my own m and I could smell my own breath that it was, day. It was after your illness. Yeah, I had a yellow you know tongue and went to the cinema. And I was like, oh, it's so sexy. And I was like, I can yeah, smell I was, my own case. I was I had like this. <laughs> it was so romantic. She woke up one day and she was back. It's really sad because on the one hand I'm out of it and I'm like, okay, that's just my story, right? I had postpartum depression. Yeah. It's gone now. Okay, it's don't. completely gone. gone. But then on the other hand, I'm like, oh, why did it have to happen the first year of Ziggy's life? Just forget about it. Act like nothing sad, happened, Rosie. Just forget about it. Just block Fine it out. Now, though. Just bury it. Happy to be back. Just bury it like you, you don't need wisdom teeth. <laughs> I don't know why I've stopped breastfeeding or not now because the day I stop breastfeeding, I'm having Botox, I'm having lip filler, I'm having a mummy makeover. Babe, babe, you don't need lip filler. You babe, need babe, all the rest, but not lip just filler. Little bit. I won't be like. If you get lip filler, it's going to accentuate your hairy lip. Should we give a coffee after this? I'd love to. I don't actually drink coffee anymore since my food poisoning. No. Since your food poisoning. food poisoning, I actually have given up sugar and caffeine for nearly three weeks. Yeah. Shut up. We had a bar of chocolate last night. Shh. I can lie to the internet if I want to. Right. Anyway, so you're back, and I'm loving it. So we're having a lot more time together. Yeah, Ziggy's going. Don't to get me wrong. I love the boy. I said this on a live stream yesterday. Just yesterday. I love boy, and yes, that's his nickname. It's been his nickname since he was eight weeks old. Boy. And what I also mean? love Bobby, and I like some time with Bobby. Yeah. Are you wearing a bra? Yes. Don't bother. I bought That's Rosie a, a life drawing session <gasps> for her birthday. I drew a naked lady and we became friends. Yeah, I said I said friends. this on the member stream yesterday. I'm quite worried because we're good friends now. But she was naked the whole time. And you're like, yeah, yeah. Fine. it wasn't like she was naked. It was like she wasn't. That makes it worse. And in return, Rosie's going to buy me a flying lesson that I pussied out. I want to get my private flying license. To do that, I have to fly a plane. Now that's my biggest fear, but also my greatest accomplishment because I want to take control of that bitch and fly it myself. Would you say that's your greatest fear in the whole world is flying? My biggest fear ever is losing everything and wasps. Yeah, but it's not your biggest fear. Drowning. Your biggest fire. fire. Oh my god, babe. Dinosaurs. Take a fear. I'm gonna. I've got many. But Rosie, I have you met flying. me? I think flying is my biggest one. I've got to so overcome. The point I'm making is, is that if it's your biggest fear and then you conquered it by going in a plane, that's insane. That's an incredible thing, and no one can take that away from you. No one can unless. I die in the plane. Anyway, so yeah, I pussied out. Um, I will do it. I'm gonna go up in a plane. I'm gonna be. I'm gonna be Are a you? sexy pilot. <laughs> Babe, she'll be having another Nando's. I'm not even joking. Go. Now, don't forget, Rosie and I. Fortunately, fingers crossed. Over the last four years, we have never caught COVID. Right? No, I've never. Because had COVID. we're so terrified of being ill, especially me. We just don't do anything. Don't go anywhere. I just, to touch I basically, anyone. I just can't be bothered for. If I if I didn't have the baby, I would have caught COVID now. But I can't be bothered to have COVID and still get up in the night, breastfeed. We're starting to go out again. Yeah, we are. But I'm scared. Maybe that's why we had depression, Rosie, because we didn't do anything or go anywhere. Do I look 34? <laughs> no. Do I look thick? Don't answer. Do. Cool. How does it feel about um, a boy going to nurse we now? Ah, oh, fine with it. Should we go and get a decaf coffee and be crazy bitches, Rosie? Yeah. Shall we? Yeah. If you're also a crazy bitch, why don't you check out Surfshark using the link in the description box below. Check out our offer. It's 83% off, three extra months for free. Why wouldn't you? All right, guys, make sure you take care of yourselves. Uh, we're going to be uploading lots of stuff on the vlogging channel this month and also the gaming <laughs> channel. That's your boob. And maybe next time you see me, I'll be blonde. <laughs>